I just bought this Kingsington Veramark fingerprint scanner, which allows you to scan your fingerprint to unlock your Windows laptop or desktop computer. And as in the stores, they've been coming out with newer laptops with built-in fingerprint readers to work with the new Windows 10 Windows Hello feature. And uh, if you don't have a computer that doesn't have a fingerprint reader built in, you can just buy this one, which is like $50, to uh, do that for you. And this comes with a little uh, keychain cap that you can use to carry around with you if you want. But I have this plugged into my Dell gaming laptop. And it's the size of a small wireless mouse receiver. And on the top of it is where the scanner is. So right now, light is blue meaning it's waiting for my finger to tap it to unlock my computer so I go ahead and just touch it and it's already unlocking my computer I can go ahead and lock the screen and show you that it doesn't matter what angle scans the finger it will still unlock the computer so I could tap it pointing up and it unlocks the computer lock it again I can scan my finger pointing down and it unlocks my computer so it works pretty fast it's almost as fast as a touch ID or unlocking an Android phone with a fingerprint scanner so I could show you how to scan another finger. So you go to the start control panel, account settings, and sign in options. And then there's a feature saying, uh, hello, Windows hello. And then for fingerprint, you want to add another finger. So to get started, and it also, it also requires you to enter a PIN number um, just in case something goes wrong with the fingerprint. So let me type that in. So now it'll tell you to scan the new finger. So I'll scan my thumb. And it'll tell you to scan your finger a couple times until it tells you when it has read the entire finger. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 11, 12, 13, I'll try different angles. It's about like a dozen scans. So now it will ask you to scan the edge of your finger. Two, three, and then that's it. So I'll go ahead and unclose and close this window. And let me lock the computer again. And then now I can then unlock my computer with my thumb. Just tap it. And it locks my computer. So it's very easy to use, easy to program, and uh, I can also show you what happens if you try to scan a different finger or scan the wrong finger. I'll lock the, the, the screen. So if I scan my uh, pinky finger, it'll say a uh, can't recognize the finger, make sure you recorded it in your Windows Hello uh, system. So I bet you try to scan another time. Just couldn't recognize the finger. Let me try another time. And oops, yeah, three strikes and you're out. And it requires your PIN uh, number to log into your computer. Yeah, and also I try to do a fourth time. It'll glow red if it's a wrong finger, and it'll actually turn off. So 
but then it requires my PIN number to unlock the computer again. So, so far, this fingerprint scanning system is the best I've ever used. Relatively inexpensive for $50. It's plug and play, doesn't require any software needed, it installs by itself. And it gives the ability for any Windows laptop or desktop to unlock your computer for you. And I would recommend this for anybody who wants to secure their laptop from anybody trying to steal their information or to access or hack into their laptop. This is a great way to uh, secure it for you. So I would recommend getting this Kingsington Veramark fingerprint scanner if you're at all interested in securing your laptop from anybody trying to get access to it and you're too lazy to type in any long passwords. Just uh, tap it and it unlocks you their computer. So, finger on.